These are crisis times in the community blood supply. Yes. And we are in significant jeopardy of not being able to meet patients' transfusion needs. Hospitals have been called on to reduce the number of elective procedures they're doing. What we want to be sure of, though, is that we're going to have enough of a blood supply, diminished as it is, to ensure that all those emergency procedures can be met. The hemorrhages after a childbirth, the transplants, uh, the cardiovascular surgeries. So we want to make sure that there is blood available for those sorts of crises that might emerge during those procedures. And at the moment, we cannot say that there will be enough. We can't say that with confidence because the blood supply at the moment is in jeopardy. We have got to this point, and it's not just here at Carter Blood Care, it's nationwide there is a shortage of donated blood. And the reason is this. With closure of businesses, with schools, colleges and universities being closed, with houses of worship being closed, with instructions to stay in place, to shelter at home, these have significantly inhibited our ability to send out mobile units to get the blood supply that we really needed to meet all the hospital's needs. Our community needs transfusion support every day of the week for more than 600 people. And these are individuals, whether there's a corona pandemic or not, they need the blood. So I urge you, go to www.carterbloodcare.org and make an appointment at one of our neighborhood centers. And make that appointment because the community needs you and the need is now.